Liberals never tire in their barrage of nasty attacks on Melania Trump, as they've been tireless in their pursuits to slander her ever since she took on the role of America's first lady. From making fun of her accent, to bashing her mothering skills, to making ridiculous statements about her attire, their nasty vitriol truly knows no bounds. But after a wildly successful week with her visit to Saudi Arabia and Israel where she shined brightly and represented our country in ways that even had the Saudi Arabian media praising her, liberals wasted no time trying to twist one thing that Melania did while walking alongside her husband shortly after arriving in Israel, that has now spurred the left's latest feeding frenzy. But unfortunately for these liberals, they didn't quite get their facts straight about what went down on the tarmac in Israel, proving yet again what giant buffoons they truly are. One of the left's favorite narratives to push about the Trumps is that there's deep marital problems going on behind the scenes, as many liberal body language experts have come out in recent months with their expert analysis of Trump and Melania's relationship, asserting that their marriage is on the rocks, or that their marriage is just one of a convenience. So liberals were quick to scrutinize what Melania did on the tarmac in Israel shortly after the couple disembarked from the plane where they pointed out that Melania slapped away President Trump's hand as he appeared to reach back to hold her hand. Numerous leftist media outlets ran with the story, with the cackling hens on The View offering their expert analysis and making the wild claim that Melania simply can't stand her husband, which was why she didn't want to hold his hand. Maybe she thought he was reaching over to pinch her on the butt, said a trollish Whoopi Goldberg she can't stand him, said Joy Beer, another frequent critic. After watching the clip numerous times, the View ladies car paid on what they said was Trump's often blurish behavior toward his wife, picking apart other instances when they said he had been less than gentlemanly let alone presidential. But leave it to the fact-checking geniuses on the left to jump on the conspiracy bandwagon before actually researching what the local customs are in Israel, which would have saved them quite a lot of embarrassment. Donald Trump News pointed out that according to Israeli culture, it is deemed impolite holding hands in public or PDA, the acceptable thing is going side by side. So basically, Melania was just being a good wife and helping preserve a positive image of her husband, as she was quick to brush away his hand as a way to adhere and respect the local customs of the host country they were visiting. Despite the constant insults that the left tries and throw at her, Melania has been nothing but the epitome of grace and class ever since taking on her role as America's first lady. Her keen eye and attention to detail has saved President Trump from liberal media scrutiny in the past, when she kindly nudged her husband's hand during the White House Easter egg roll when he got distracted and forgot to place his hand over his heart. She's simply doing what any good wife would do, which of course liberals have to twist and contort in order for it to fit their Trump-hating agenda. We finally have a first family in the White House that truly love this country and are trying their damnedest to get America back on the right path after the Obamas took a freaking wrecking ball to our nation. It's truly sick how the liberal love fest for the Obamas continues, despite Barack Hussein Obama committing treason against our country for the past eight years, but liberals won't even give Trump a chance at being a success, as they continue to throw around the world treason and impeachment while peddling their fake news and propaganda about the first family. Here's more from our source, regardless of the repeated views of this video, it's clear that the allegations made by the mainstream media are based on nothing. They have gone out of their way to make something from this even so far by calling into question the Trump's relationship. The media has gone too far this time. Melania has done nothing else but support her husband. Before going on public and making these allegations maybe the mainstream media should do its research, at least that's what journalism is. In Israeli culture it is deemed impolite holding hands in public or PDA, the acceptable thing is going side by side. So if Melania is guilty of anything that is of respecting their culture, she is an incredible lady and doesn't deserve this kind of treatment. Remember Melania has nudged Trump's hand at the White House Easter egg roll when he got distracted and forgot to place his hand over his heart. Wives nudge husbands all the time for public things they should slash shouldn't do. No big deal. Please do not forget to subscribe and like and comment because we want to hear your voice and thank you for watching.